Hello everyone, let's play Clash of Clans episode 26 and let's get right into it. I haven't played for a while. I'm sorry to say add the time, I've been to the beach, etc. Stuff like that. So when I do get some free time I will be doing more and more videos. I'm sorry. The why our army is training up, I've been attacked twice. Most I've been attacked more which I haven't seen. So I haven't been on for about two days. So let's just show you this attack on me. As you can see, I think this is the first one. He brought in a lot of barbarians up the top. I only had two barbarians in my clan castle, but he's just spamming in all his barbarians. My mortar's doing a good job, but barbarians still have a lot of health, so a good tank or meat shield. It fires in by more barbarians, which I think is a bad choice. Because they're all going around the edge, because all my buildings are tight. When they, do, they finally get in, then he does bring archers in after a while, and then two wall breakers. Maybe he should have sent in the first wall breaker because it only takes one wall breaker to get through. So he could have done that. So he is into my middle, but I'm not sure if he's going to take too much with his few troops. Of what I think he should have done is go for my mines, because as you can see, they're full. But he does waste a lightning spell. It don't. Well, it does take out one mortar, which I think might actually saved him, because that mortar would have one shot at all them archers. So that. I'm sorry if that's a bad decision. But I think that wasn't a bad, but it was very low health anyway, so I'm not sure basically one arrow would have killed it. So five seconds left, ain't got that much else to do. And that's the end of that battle. And to our army will be trained up. Our army will be trained up in about nine minutes, which is quite long, but it is getting longer and longer. I think I want to show you a couple more defences. Just watch the Ruby from Toxic Clan. Let's watch Jeremy attack us. He did use two lightning spells. I expect him, sorry for the volume. Um, I do expect him, as I thought, to put them in the middle. I would have thought him to just drop it on that mortar. Because they won't take out that wizard tower. Because the wizard tower does have a lot of health or no level. Or non upgraded wizard, not wizard, um, lightning spells. So he does use a lot of barbarians again, but he's coming in from the way I kind of want him to, which I'm pretty happy about. Just like more of them around, like funnel them around so I can get a lot of damage on them. But yes, bring it, they are funneling them around there, which I'm not too happy about. But that wizard has getting its shots on there. Okay, they're starting to hit through the wall and with no splash damage attacking, but then he's coming through the funneling and that wizard has doing a tremendous amount of damage. As you can see, it's hitting like 30 of them. 30 times like 11, that's how much damage per second it's doing, or how many seconds that bomb. Just what I'm planning. Now I think that's another bomb. Maybe just got that, mate. They're just that close on getting into the wall. As you can see, it ain't gonna be too hard for them. Well, it's not gonna be too hard for my defense to finish off the last couple of bearings. That weren't really a successful attack, they used too many. While we're talking, let's just refill my spring traps and bombs. Because a lot of them have been used up. Okay, let's just get rid of some of these while we wait. I think there's one more defence, and that is from a Chinese or Japanese person, I'm not too sure. And this is only a minute long. So a lot of said, I expect them to get from my mines and pumps. Again with the mass barbarian on my town hall, my mortar can't reach, so it's not that bad. So it's not okay. Looks like them ones that'll go into my bundling bit, and that wizard has a start doing a lot of damage on them. They think like they've got a free building. They're just gonna go around. It's just gonna be loads of spring traps and that wizard have mowing all down their troops as it is right now. So I think that is uh, just gonna work our way around. Might take until the army camp or the pump because there's no splash damage. All well, there is, but all well, well, there is, but it's still gonna take a while. And that's the end of them troops. They haven't really had successful attacks in this base. A couple where they take up one storage, but not really. That's one of them, so they're not really successful attacks. So this base is holding itself. And it's been very good. Oh look, we've got our level three. What have we got? We've got level 3 archers now. So we've got level 3 archers and barbarians. 
and we can upgrade goblins or wizard or um, I don't really use them that much. Um, I think I am gonna upgrade my goblins because I get to use them a lot more down the lower levels. So I think I will save up for that. We have got our two free builders, so maybe I want to upgrade this and that, and so we can expand a lot more. Let's just get rid of our last trunks. So there's a couple more left. No, I can't show you because I went on them. But that balloon attack I did fail pretty hard. When as you guys know. That's a pretty hard fail attack, but usually balloon attacks are very successful and very good, I think. And um, I will be doing the uh, base review channel 7 right after this video, maybe about an hour or two after. But, um, not really nothing to it. Make sure when you do, um, do when you put your base down, try not to get it destroyed or nothing, because I don't think the viewers do like that, or you would like your base destroyed getting reviewed, and it's hard for me to do so hopefully there ain't none and we have got enough people I think there might be one town or nine in there I'm not too sure I'm picking them at random I think there's four or five requests oh I didn't see that gold there so we've got 94,000 gold we've got quite a lot of elixir actually I'm just getting all the gold from my pumps and mines I don't really have to do a battle but I might do one for you guys it's just gemma because I think you're getting bored of waiting I don't blame you there go, let's do an awesome attack, get our lovely troops up, or epic troops up to get stronger. I wish I could upgrade my giants, but I can't. There till the next, um, what is it called, laboratory upgrade. They do cost like half a million or something. Mm. Oh, this is a good base. 40 ish thousand of each. So town was six, so I have to take that everything. Um, I'm not worried about up here, so I'm ignoring them defences and that. But I think... I'm not too sure. Got quite a lot of defences, and I do want to get three stars to get up on the trophies. So I think I'll go for a base. Um, I do want elixir. I want about 20,000 elixir and about 50,000 gold. This is a nice space. But that was a terrorist direct in the middle. I know you think it's not that hard to get to, but it will be of all my troops. So only town with five, that's a good base by the looks of it. Um something if I know it's not lucky, but if you have a base like this, swap out that mortar with the in middle gold storage and swap that with an hour out with like her elixir, that'd be a good swap. The only reason I do want to upgrade my elixir is so uh, well before I go I'm after, I might buy um, one of the other ones of each, so just acting as a mutual level one, I'll talk about more of that after this battle, because I think I've decided I want to go for this. Everything's on this side, which I think I could just go mass right in and take it out. There's no plan. These defences here aren't really going to interrupt me, maybe that more I will. This will be an easy base, I think. Can we bring it? Um... I should have done, done that, I should have dropped the distraction, but it worked anyway. Drop them, because no, oh, oh. So they broke through. Let's drop some things down here. I'll just drop everything straight away, get to as much damage as I can. So we're getting in, destroying everything. I do want to get one or two stars, so I'm going to drop my things off. Around, but there's no other things in the corner. Just so want to drop back to distract that mortar. Oh. So that was one mortar shell distracted, and that was distracted for a couple of seconds. So it'll be a two or three star, I just have a feeling, because we're at 46% and we're working on the town hall. And uh, yeah, once that town hall's done, we're going to have two stars. And that would be a lot of truth because you just have 34 available. I'm not actually too sure this will be a free star. That mortar's making it wink on won't. And then cannons do have a lot of health, so I don't think this will be a free star. But it's very close to a free star. Look out. There's only one single defense. If them archers might have been attacking that mortar instead of the wall, this would have been a free star. And I would think so. Just finishing off that last war. I am going to leave it because you don't know what could happen. So this is actually, they shoot for that mortar. So I say if they shop, I'm going to end it here, but 
If they um, destroy that mortar before it's shot, I think this would have been a free star, but that weren't too bad. We still took away 22 trophies and all that golden elixir. So that's right. This is basically um, a free builder. I don't have to spend a builder on it, so that's it. And I think I am going to upgrade this as well. So yeah, I've got 60,000 to play around with. This is level 6. That's level 5 and level 5. I think um, that's 80,000, so that's not too much more to do. I've got enough to train up army. So what could we spend 80,000 on or 60,000 on? I do want to spend it on something to do with gold, set from walls, so I do want to get this builder up. I'm not too sure about spending it on one of them. They're all level 6, except from that. So I might actually get this up because all my gold mines aren't actually no no not. So I might just without a spare builder just do a knees up to level six. So let's start that. Let's get some walls up. Let's get two. That's what two walls can I get up? Um, I think I'm gonna do here. Let's start from here. One, two, just like that, and we can upgrade that. And now we haven't got really too much elixir gold to get stolen off us. Let's just train up a few arts just in case I need to donate them. So get looking forward to the base review. Hopefully in this video you can like and comment on it and tell me what I need to approve on. And subscribe if you haven't for more Clash of Clans content. Peace out guys, this has been Let's Play Clash of Clans, episode 26. Bye.